after months and months of not filming, I've actually had many plans and ideas of videos that I want to record, but I just moved recently and it's been very, very hectic. I keep traveling back and forth from my new place and the old place, so I always have to, you know, plan out everything. But this week I got a Neo Kill package and I got a bunch of goodies and I just decided to film myself storing some new items since I don't think I'm gonna film a full collection anytime soon. I hope all of you are doing all right and thank you so much for the support even though I've been slacking but I really hope that this year I can get more into it. So without further ado, let's get started. So we're gonna start with my Daikian binder and I'm so excited because Chang, I made a binder cover finally well like a page cover and I think it turned out super super cute I was so nervous because I actually ripped up two of my what is love albums for this and I was so scared since I've like never done this before so I've got my signed pages at the back the reason I ripped up the albums was actually to incorporate the signed pages with her pictures but it just wasn't working and I was too scared to rip up the signature so I just placed it here at the back. I think it's fine for now. So first we have Dahyun's KB postcard. I'm so happy. This is like one of these things that like I never really thought I'll have because like I rarely see it anyways and when I saw it, it was a really good price. I don't think it was more than $10 um, probably because it's like sun damage and it has quite a few scruffs you can see but honestly i saw it on the photos and i couldn't care less it's like a rare item in my eyes so and i got it for a good price so i was like i don't have this so let's figure out where i'm gonna put her since to me it is like a rare item it would have to be like here my rare item page but let me shuffle a bit and see what will figure something out now we have something super exciting which is the formula of love file edition set and this officially completes my daikin album card collection i am so excited as you can see i decorated some cards because i had like these and i was like you know what might as well use them so here we go this is how this page looks at the moment the plan is to get a taste of love or benefit just put it here or I'll just get a second copy of this card either way but I know that I have the card so it's like I know the collection is complete it's just not in the spender so yay finally oh my god I love it so much it's so pretty I'm still contemplating if I want to trade one of these fan sign cards or one that looks more like this so i have like you know that like each three cards like fit but i'm not quite sure yet like cards are so like look so similar which i really don't like but at the same time they're so cute so it's like i want them all to like you know cooperate but this is how we're gonna leave it for now i'm really happy that i'm finally done and now i need to find a space for the postcard it's gonna slide in this postcard here i had the ost polaroid here but i'm just gonna pop it from the back for now yeah we'll find a spot for it later now i just want to make sure that everything that i really need is in my binder so many blank spots finally got the season's greeting cards the japanese one and the korean one finally so i'm happy to be able to put these away now Super happy to finally have these. She looks so pretty, the brown hair. And if you watch my last like collection video, which I know it's been like a while, a lot of things have changed, but I just recently redid like my non-album cards and I added my pre-order cards with the non-albums. Before I used to have pre-order and monograph cards separate. Now I just added them. One more thing, which is the Wednesday postcard and photo cards it's super cute well technically it's twice anniversary but it's also once party you know 
I got this set. Oh, here we go. This is so cute. I love this whole concept with them like being like little chefs and stuff. It's super cute. I don't really like how the signature is like a shadow around it. I don't know if you like can tell what I mean, but it looks like I don't know why they couldn't just maybe because it's white and they want you to see it better, but I don't know. It looks like someone just like Photoshop like yeah, they did Photoshop it on, but like I don't know. I hope you know what I mean. It's like here. I'm going to put her in my other postcard binder because it's like a non-album thing. So for this binder, that's it. I'm always happy to add more things to my Dashing collection. I'm so happy I'm finally like done with her album card collection. It's crazy. Like I don't even remember when I started collecting Dashian. It's a while. But to be able to say that I like have all of her album cards is actually crazy to me. Wait, actually I'm missing one Instagram Thailand edition. The last card I'm missing. I'm livid but if you don't count like the thailand editions then i'm completely done at this point where i'll just buy like a dupe or like a replica of that card because it's just you know like aesthetic wise definitely a need fyi in case you see like here like i'm missing card means the card is in my other twice binder which means i'm collecting ot9 for that card so I'm still contemplating if I want to rebuy the cards that I have in my other binder. So I'll have them in both binders. But then again, I'm like, I know my collection. I know that I have the cards. They're just in another binder. Since I don't have this card, the layout kind of works. Because like 3, 2, 2. I wanted to explain that. Because some places I have like white, like blank spaces. But I do have the card. Yep, but that's it for this binder. Now we're gonna get to the postcards. I bought a set of her EDC postcards for a pretty good price. And like this year, I really want to invest more in these concert postcards. If another Japanese proxy pops up, like you know me, I'm a Neo Kyo girl in a Neo Kyo world, but Neo Kyo and Makari like stopped their partnership or something. It was tragic, but I was relieved that I placed my last order the day before. Hope that, you know, a new proxy pops up. Oh, also, new update is my official postcard binder. I used to have these in my, like, other Daikin binder, but now they have their own spot, and I love it. It's super cute, 2018. It's a cover. They have, like, some soft cover ones, but I really wanted a hard cover one. Yeah, the postcard, I put it in here. Let me fix it up. see if this postcard fits in here i hope this one fits so let's try yes it fits perfectly oh thank god okay wait it's the wrong side this is so cute i didn't even see this super cute i wish i knew what it says like i'm it's probably like thank you once for six amazing years i love you like that's what i'm guessing or let's have more amazing time. Out of all of these, these are my favorites. Her as the pizza delivery. Oh my god, it reminds me of Yes or Yes. Like, always when I see these skirts, like this outfit, it reminds me of Yes or Yes. I love these. She's so pretty. Okay, we get it. You love that hand. I'm gonna do a little flip through. So that's it. Super, super cute. All right, now to my I need you to smile binder. Still need to get a new binder, but you know, it does the job. It's this set, it's one of my favorite sets. I remember in the beginning, I was like, I'm not really gonna collect or like OT9 unit cards. Like, I was only collecting the ones that Dahin was in, but I just love it. And just in case you don't know, these ones at the bottom sharp corners are the taiwanese edition like a lot of people aren't aware or think that these are like fake or something but no they're official I've done quite some progress new edition for this page i've got momo set and i have feel special jungyeon super cute someone tell me to stop doing this because 
not smart. Ta-da! I love these color borders. Like, I know, like, everyone that colors, or almost everyone that colors OT9 has this set. Because it's just so pretty. Like, I know some people don't like it, and that's totally fair. But I just love the member colors so much. So I, as you can see, I'm working on it. also have Nina for Taste of Love. You ever like think you, you're getting a card and then you're not sure so you basically just have to wait and see if you get it that's where i'm at right now have the group cards finally i've got these two group cards and i put them in eight pockets just because they're like um horizontal and i was like you know what might as well i already okay now i don't remember i think it's like this i was like might as well use these eight pockets since I have them. And hello. As soon as twice does more and I don't have enough eight pockets, I'll just put them back to back. But for now, I actually like seeing the bags because they're very colorful. Some of them are even glittery. I know most people don't even like the group cards are like freebies to them. Member cards are technically like actual tickets. I still like them a lot. But Cha-ching! I've got the collect book from the 6th anniversary. It's so cute. And I've decided to put my miscellaneous cards in here. Um, because I'm selectively collecting OT9 cards of members like this Jungian. This Jungian is just my everything. And this one as well. But I don't think I'm going to collect OT9 for these sets. So this is why I really wanted this binder to put them in here and have like twice in their own thing. I'm not like rushing to collect selectively OT9, but there's definitely a couple cards that I just love, especially Jungyeon, What is Love era. I love her cards with the pink beanie. It's just it. All right, here we have the collect book. So I think Lightning's card on the front. Here we go. Oh my God, it's so cute. Okay, okay, okay. So I'm going to put the group cards first. So this is the group card Taste of Love key ring. And then this is the group card from Love Love. And it doesn't fit. I put it on without a sleeve for now. But as soon as I get a sleeve that Because I know these probably aren't PVC free. So this is just for now. I forgot how tight these like pockets are. So I might have to re-sleeve. A lot of these yeah I don't think these are gonna fit so I'm gonna do this off camera but I mean you get the plan I'm just gonna put the rest of the cards in here now continuing in this binder since it's not only twice in here if we go back of course we have Luna which I'm so happy I finally done with and I decided to not collect like all her cards I just collected my favorites and then all the pops and I got this I'm pretty sure it's an Apple music pop it's like one of my favorite VV cards I love that card so I'm super 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 happy to have it so now if we go back back we've got Sogi and I've got finally finally rbb rbb as you can see i wrote it on the note i said first come means any card i get my hands on because there's two versions and i bought this with a set with the album so it came with the full album oh i actually put a sleeve in already oops and this was the card and honestly i soggy does a lot of horizontal cards biggest fan of them just because you know like night pockets but I do really like like the card itself. I really didn't have a preference between this one and the other one. Like the only thing would have been, yeah, the other one is like critical. Happy to have this page complete finally. So please, if you have the perfect leveled one, please, please let me know. Exactly the card I want where she's doing this face. I think I nailed it with my drawing. Um, but this card, oh my gosh. So that's it for this binder. To my first A5 binder. In my purple one, I keep like my more active collections. And then my clear one is like less active, I guess. So these are all the cards that I have. Quite a few. I'm so excited. We just sent collection. 
is growing that hard to collect it's more just like there's nothing really around you know like barely or the cards that i want aren't around so these are all were all trades i love this card so much and the layout is a little weird so this is one of my absolute favorite card y z y um chinese fan sign card i love this card i love it so much so i'm so glad to have it unnatural was like the official era where i became like an ujung i would say or it was at least like my first official comeback like i think i became interested in them right when i came out but you know i wouldn't count it because like i wasn't there when like the teasers dropped but unnatural it's also the only widgets and album that i have right now love their music and if you haven't checked them out yet i would definitely recommend because their amazing vocals and performance and then i have this 2020 seasons greetings card it's so cute super cute this is actually i think this is the pop one of these is the pop i think it's this one um or maybe it's this one since these are both white backgrounds i'm not quite sure i don't remember and these are the most recent season's greetings and now i'm focusing on getting broadcast cards unit cards we have itsy i've got the two light stick cards that i got in a little set super cute so i'm pretty sure yeah this is the first one this is like the light stick card and this is the light stick case card it's giving soccer mom i love it and then i also have christmas no bad day card i'm pretty sure it's not, no it's not no bad day it is just I, maybe it's like a sound wave sorry but they have so many pops this here and then the first light stick i'll put it here for now this is it for now and then for che i have this blank spot still a lot to be decided you know the whole layout um what i do really like the four page layout for is this page which is one of my favorites i got like the target exclusive cards i just really like them because of the like color border and then i'm collecting this special edition like that's it for this binder so this is my second a5 binder um and here i keep kind of collections that aren't growing as fast or people that don't put out that much stuff that i want to collect kind of like that so first we have aisha from everglow for her i do want to collect like more of her stuff i love her cards and stuff but it's not that i don't see them around it's just the prices are quite expensive for a lot of the things so i'm kind of like mm. so that's why it's going kind of slow but i finally have this card it's so cute arrival of everglow and i'm pretty sure this is the korean version and then this is the american version or english version something like that this has to be one of my favorite photo cards like out of all the cards i own okay we've got a new four pocket just for one group card i can't but i do like the group card since i might want to collect Honda as well i know it's like why are you collecting another member if you can't collect one let's see so i'll just put these like this for now be grateful to have the v life fan club this card is also one of my favorite cards like aisha's cards are just top tier and then when we go to the back we're just gonna skip past bts like there's a lot like let me just show this like a lot of things going on there we'll talk about it once i get more of their cards got these two cards yay i'm so excited i've been waiting for this album card i'm only missing technically i still want to get the one with the blue background but just because i got this one and i'm pretty sure this is a pop oops since i've got this one i'm pretty sure it's like a pop i know it's not an album card but i do really like it so but since it feels like the four pockets perfectly i'll just keep it in here for now and i don't think i'll i mean if i see the other card i might get it but then i don't know like how to place everything 
but like in all in all i really like my jenny collection so a lot of collections are in jeopardy until i find a new proxy I'm way more active now like on instagram which reminds me of instagram prizes and makes me sad um also new i think is wakimeki dua and doyan are my biases in wakimeki still not sure 100 if i like commit to collecting wakimeki but for now i'm like it's not hurting anyone and elwars let's, let's talk about elwars no actually let's talk about elwars because where are my girls at where are my girls i miss them so much like every time i flip on my binder that's why they're in the back because it makes me sad if i see them like first thing when i open my binder but i'm so proud of my elders collection so missing dudes too and broadcast cards and like every time i see i see someone sold like a cotton cast card for like ten dollars and i'm like that could have been me that should have been me i hope 2022 they'll have a comeback like they change companies like i don't know like i'm not giving up i just can't give up on these girls i i'm too attached to them like their music just them like so if you don't know Elris, please check them out. Their latest comeback is called Jackpot and it's so good. The whole album, the whole thing is good. Like it's so good. I can recommend this. Check them out. BTS, please. We're not looking at BTS right now. <laughs> I've actually progressed in BTS, but I don't really want to show y'all because I ordered more cards. So you'll see when those get here. Now actually back to my other A5 binder because I forgot to put something in. So talking about we just and i actually have some more things which are like some bigger inclusions i already have this and the seller also gave me this id which i also already have but still very nice thank you now i need to find space to put these so this is great i love this polaroid like usually i wish this was a photo card because i love this photo but it's okay it gets a pass because i love the photo so she's just gonna go in here it works right and then these postcards usually fit like in these pockets but they get damaged i've seen like that's why my hours my other like um these they get like damaged but here i'm like not too concerned like i don't love it but we we'll have to find a way right so i've got some one page sleeves just kind of sad with these cards but honestly i'd rather do this and have non-damaged cards than you know damaged cards this is from the photo book the other one is from the season's greetings yeah i love the holographic it's so pretty on camera it's way more holographic than in real oh my god oh and then this one you know what it's not worth the damage i see it better at the back yeah we don't need more damage the layout is gonna be a little wacky but honestly i'd rather a wacky layout than damaged goods she's just gonna be here at the back and then the standy thingy i have so many of these i have like six of these please if you want one i'll give you for free like you just have to pay shipping like i have so many of these i also have multiple of these if you're interested let me know once i get anything else it'll go in here hopefully it's like smaller so it doesn't get damaged because like size wise it's perfect but like it's too close to the rings okay now we're done with this binder now we've got this binder haven't seen her in a minute so we've got stacy in here she had like a lot of my stacy things for sale even my polaroid and now i'm like i ain't giving her away she's here in the middle in the center and i'm collecting ot6 i bought cards i also bought a couple out like sets that i'll be trading for other cards for stacy i'm just trying to trade i'm not really trying to buy a lot but i'm definitely looking to trade if you are someone you know collect stacy please like leave their name so i can like study lay them out especially if they collect ot6 because uh best it's a little confusing once you at the back are replicas obviously they're by chaebom we all know who chaebom is come on to actual news we have miss hyuna and can y'all believe i have additions yeah i know it's crazy one two three four five 
well actually three because two of these i already have but i also have all the albums i'll show y'all later i've got like for each card i've got the cd so i don't know where i'm gonna put those but you know i mainly bought it for the cards but i already have this one and i already have this one it was like right like bent like in the corner of it so it has like edge damage but honestly it's not that bad like i think if you just lay it flat but i'll be putting this and this one up for trade for the ones that i'm missing i know it's gonna be kind of hard because i barely see these around and if they're so expensive art yeah this is why and then yeah this is dream country okay that wasn't that hard one of my favorite like this you know card like her solo card is one of my favorites out of all of these but it came with a group card and honestly obviously i would rather want her solo but at least the seller put in the group card like i'm not complaining at all because now i can fill up everything and even if it's a group card you know it's not just like blank which i think is cute how should this be laid out like this or like this i think like this i think Hina is definitely not easy no honestly i think out of all the groups i and people i collect Hina is the hardest just not even price wise mainly also like just finding her stuff because everyone that collects Hina, you know collects her and isn't gonna sell their collection and if people do sell their collection they obviously want their money worth back and a lot of these things are like super rare now you barely see them around like at all see it's not impossible but it's not easy at all okay here we go they've all got obviously like sun damage and stuff but i'm not mad at that because like some of these are really old i'm really not complaining i'm so happy about this so only missing two more wow i have Dun, dun, dun. these two editions yes i'm collecting momoland now who is in the group anymore but she was my bias i bias all the older girls and like i keep up with them i'm trying to like get into like collecting them so when i saw this set for the postcard i just like copped it <laughs> um now i'm just thinking where i'm gonna put them in my clear a5 binder you know where i kind of keep like miscellaneous groups and stuff I'm just keep them in there for now oh my god they're so cute yeah let's do that okay so i'm then i think i put them right between alerts no you know what i'll put them before hours to be honest I'll be collecting them more than hours unless hours brings out something hey okay these will be cute yeah i love this i'm just gonna show you guys the albums that i got if you only came for photo cards thank you for watching so these are all the albums why they all oops still have like this the back in it and one of them comes with stickers this one is quite dirty like something sticked on it i'm not sure what it is but I'm trying not to touch it much but i'm pretty sure yeah it comes like with a two cds and i'm not that familiar with like four minute as a group i do know i do know quite a few songs but like as a group themselves i'm not that familiar with them so like i don't know all of these songs love the suits this one also has two cds and music also has two CDs.